Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome back to Foundation. Uh, in the last episode we finished off our sort of stately manor homey type thing, but these aren't, this, is, this isn't the, the sort of high point of the kingdom. Oh no, this is for like a couple of well-to-do established gentry type folks. We need somewhere for the big boss to go and the big boss is going to go away from all the peasants over here on this island. I don't know why, but I just feel like this island sits itself really nice to get like a big fort on it, all right? Okay, it'd be really nice if there was no more land here, like if all of this was just seen. It was just like a like a Mont Saint-Michel type jobby. Um, but alas, that is not what we uh, uh, not what we have available, I don't think. So first things first, we need to get these uh, sheep out of the way. So rather than uh, knock them all down, I'm gonna build them back up again. So sheep farm, uh, I'm gonna try and put them relatively uh, close to each other over here. This is where they were originally, actually. Um, and then I was going to try and make this area something much different, but no, no, they're going to be sheep farms. So we'll get them done. Um, and then, because then I want to replace those sheep. It's not the best place for them, actually. Eventually, as I've said a few times, I would like all of this to be uh, city, and I would like all of the farms to come and sort of sit around here, really. But that's going to be a big job if we hopefully get that far um, without the whole place falling to bits on us. But yeah, we want to, for now, we're just going to put them here, and then it won't really slow down the production at all. It'll, it's literally just moving them across this bridge. In fact, if anything, it might speed it up slightly. Um, but yeah, this is, I was originally going to have this as like its own little hamlet, but I just, I, now I've got all these mods that do awesome castles and stuff. I just kind of love the idea of doing a big, castle uh, over here so hopefully that's something we can do um, but we can't really do much until those are done well I suppose we could start because this is going to be like a dock area here so let's start having a look we've got um, this uh, castle what's it called medieval stone walls these ones these ones aren't really what we want these are more for like ruins and stuff so I mean some of the bits are handy the doors are probably quite handy but for now that's not really what we want um, we've also got this stone gate set. I'm pretty sure this is the one, even though it's called a gate. I'm pretty sure this is where a majority of that castle is going to come from. So we've got here a simple drawbridge. So how does this work? Oh, okay. Okay, that's interesting. Again, not quite don't think what I want just yet. Uh, medieval stone walls, covered bridge set. This is this uh, sort of nice long bridge that we can use. There, here we go. This is what I'm looking for. We're going to replace this flouncy little uh, little bridge here with something much sturdier, right on the water's edge there. Okay. Uh, extremity co an extremity coverage. Sounds posh, doesn't it? Central coverage. Don't necessarily want these either. I just I just want a decent bridge here, really. That's all it is. So that's gonna start. I don't know whether this is gonna work. Let's try. Yeah, that. Maybe one more. Can we go one more? No. Okay, that seems Fine, let's maybe move that, but that wants to tick there. Let's see what that looks like when people walk over it. Oh, we, oh, we won't see quite, will we? But yeah, that there, I would say is a good start. So I'm going to say start on that. Start construction on that. When that's done, we can probably get rid of this one. Hopefully that doesn't mess things up too much. These sheep farms are now done, so they can both go. All right, and then we will get our uh, staff member in there. Actually, I don't want male 1708 going in there. I want whoever was in the one over here. Ah. You can no longer go where you want to go. Reinhardt and who is this? Lily. Lily. I want Lily to work there. There we go. Lily's found a job. But they're stuck there because there's no path in. So until this bit gets built... They are, they, they are stuck there. That's Well, that's how it is, I guess. Uh, okay, let's just check this then. So, somewhere in one of these, there is a 
I'm pretty sure I downloaded it, like a like a water wheel. Um, so let's try entertainment. Is that is that in there? Keep brothel, bathhouse, barbershop, saloon. No. Oh, talking of which, I actually put one of those down. Um, here, there's a barbershop. Doesn't do anything, I don't think. I think it just uh, it just fills the space in a little. And I put down some fake houses as well. There's one. There we go. There's one. Uh, just to kind of make this place look really busy. And I was just playing around with the idea, really, to see what it looked like. And I think they look pretty good. Um, oh, we could do citizens. Now, promote all. There we go. Now, that's give us our ten citizens that we've been waiting for. That's good. It's, and it just there's a little message about I don't know if you can see that, but there's just a little tiny message here about that, uh, which is nice. Uh, which means we can now come up to here and we can unlock all of this sort of stuff. So, we can unlock a tax office. Function assignable to building parts. Okay. We can do a trade bonus. Trade bonus is 20%. That's only a good thing, right? We can also get our monastery. Uh, oh, we should have got a trade bonus there as well. Never mind. Uh, okay, three, six, nine. Okay, so from any more... Oh, there's trade bonus as well. Good. So we've got all the stuff ready for this. So the only one we haven't got now then is uh, here. We need, we need 20... Um, we need 20 of the clergy points. So from now on, whoever turns up here... We want his clergy, but the other the thing we want to check out. We now have thirteen citizens, so I want to come and check his their status. No, their how do I how do I see if somebody's a citizen? That's what I want to see. Villager list. Okay, citizen. So you are. You are getting three of your food. You are getting four of your food. That's fine. Nice food. Luxury goods. Cl goods and luxury goods. So luxury goods could be meals, could be beer. I, th I think we're currently... Oh, we're making beer, right? Okay, we're making beer. So you're getting your luxury goods. No clothes. Oh, yeah, look at that. That could just be that the, that, the, uh, that we had to move these. That there's, no, there's still no things coming in here. Why is this not getting built then? Oh, it is a little bit. There's six stone gone to it. Can I put a massive construct uh, thingy on that? General bridge. Oh. Okay. Well, let them get across then for now. Okay, now we'll delete the wooden bridge. Shall we try that again then? That obviously wasn't working very well. Uh, covered bridge set three. So let's start it here. Um, and it will... It'll swing around, right? Okay, whoops. Uh, we'll get there, we'll get there. Hold on, hold on. So, covered bridge. Uh, covered bridge. Control and horizontal mouse movement. Control and horizontal mouse movement is not making it rotate. Okay, that's fine. Kind of want it, yeah, see that to me looks even better, but no, that, that makes more sense, doesn't it, I suppose. Hmm, these things are weird, but okay. Let's, let's say that is fine, okay, and then let's put the gate on it. It does push the gate a little far out. But I can deal with it. And we can do something like that as well, just because we can. Okay, cool. And then, yeah, because these, these are for like sitting on the side, aren't they? For, for it's, a, it's a bit of a old school thing. That. I remember one of the Assassin's Creed games had those in it. And I'm going to click Start Construction. And hope. I'm going to put it on high priority. We need that done. Come on, folks. Let's get it done. There are no sheep. One, two, three, four, five sheep. One, two, three, four, five sheep. There we go. That could have been an issue as well. Is that, there were no <laughs> that we didn't have any sheep. Oh, there we go. That's getting done. Good job, folks. Let's keep it up. Okay. Uh, otherwise, then, yeah. So it seem seems that citizens are... Um, I'm assuming these are our citizens. There we go. Citizen. Not getting luxury goods. Not getting uh, services. I mean, it's all available, though, right? 
we're doing all right for profit. I think one thing we're going to have to do, I'm assuming these are all full. Yeah, one thing we're going to have to do here is, is, is mess with the system a little and double up the cores because I just, I don't want the buildings to be any bigger than they already are. So let's put you in there and say start. And that's going to double that one up. And we'll do, I'm assuming this one is full down here as well. Oh no, there's only two in uh, 40 in that one. Here, and there's only eight of 77. I, I'm assuming something's just finished. A lot of stuff open here. Okay, that's built. Yes, good start. Okay, so next then um, is we just need some like ter terry bits, right? So let's go to um, a stone gate set. I wanna, I want. Where's the towers? Small square tower, small gate. Oh, I like that. I like that one as well. Okay. Uh, here we go. Octagonal tower. Yes. Okay. So we want something like this to start off with here. Okay. The good thing I like about these, by the way, is that they use really low amounts of material for, for kind of what it is, you know. Okay, octagonal gate. We're gonna go for ramparts. Yes. Okay, good. Uh, next to this, we'll just have a regular building, I think, uh, with a with a wooden roof, though. Actually, so we'll make it look like people can come out. Yeah, there we go. That looks good. Yeah, okay. Uh, close run part. We can go on top of there. Oops, 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 oops. There we go. Yes, that's good. Okay. Um, keep. Kind of want to make a bit of an angle there to follow the path around. Bring it up a little. There we go. And the keep can have a closed roof on it. Uh, oh no, that doesn't look very good. What about a open roof with one side? I think you do that, then it goes into the right spot. Yes, there we go. Oh, perfect. Oh, it's clipping ever so slightly there. Um, so we can always do that. Does that look silly? Yeah, it does, doesn't it? That's too high. Okay, how about the other way then? How about we take this still off the grid there but just enough hmm ah, I see what we could do actually is put them down like that and then there's plenty of things with small towers that we can put in later okay okay let's go for that then how many uh, what's what's the stone is that oh look it's hardly anything is it 46 stone okay let's go for that then and then let's go into um what what are the ones that are doing these towers is that lord manor yeah okay because we want some of those so lord manor uh tower yes there we go. Now the only problem with Lord, these Lord Manors is they, these do cost to run. So that is something we're going to have to bear in mind. But I think we do need, we're going to need some of this kind of stuff because otherwise the whole place is going to look a bit dodgy. Okay, so something like that that goes into the... Yeah. Okay. And then uh, maybe a little tower just there as well. Just in there. Good. And we'll say that can go... Oh, no, it is a door. That's fine. We can totally add a door on there. Okay. Start construction of that. And there we go. So the next thing we really need to be looking at is is the windows and doors set, right? Windows set. There we go. Uh, lots of arrows. Um, now these ones we're going to have to do 
pretty much manually, right? So we can place it down there where it needs to be and then pull it up. Um, none today, thank you. We're doing fine. And then again there. Pull it up. It's a shame we can't line those up, isn't it? We're going to have to make a thing out of it because otherwise it's going to look silly. There you go. One of the one of the big rules of design: if you can't cover it up, make a thing out of it. Can't hide it. Bring attention to it. So what's what, so what we can do there? Oh, these have got turrets. Oh yeah, look at that. That's probably good for breaking the. Oops. Look at that. Yeah, that looks cool, doesn't it? Breaks that up a little. Nice. Chimney I'm not too worried about. now. ah, I'll tell you one, I'd, one I would like the look of, actually. If I can find where it is. Um, are these things that go at the bottom of this to kind of strengthen them? Uh, let's have a look. Let's put one of those in first. And then bring it right up to there. Oh, hello. That's interesting. Another one of those. Can we now? Can we now select it? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that's strange. Uh, okay, so stock structure on that seven stone. That's fine. Yeah, if we can keep it to these stone things and stuff, because these don't cost us anything. Although these buildings do have a little bit more detail, a little bit more going on to break them up. For the most part, we want to try and stick to those. Yeah, so in one of these, I'm gonna guess it's in uh, it's in Stone Gate. There's like a just like a just like a bit of stone that goes at the bottom of something to support it. Here we go, buttress. That's the word I was trying to find and couldn't. Buttress, but as in buttress, buttress, garlic. <laughs> right. So if we do something like that. And then, do, can we raise them, or is that it? That's it. Okay, that's fine. I preferred them a little bit more out of the water than that, but that's okay. And again, they are connected to the ground, unfortunately, so they are going to be at varying heights. Yeah, so that just doesn't look very good, does it? See, here, I think that'll look pretty good. Again, would be nice if they if they match the the height of the building. But oh, there was a there was a there was a oh no, just on each other. I was gonna say there was a snap point there, but this is a different building, isn't it? Of course. Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna worry about any of these side on bits just yet because I'm quite honestly haven't quite figured them out. Uh, why can't we start construction of those then? It has one core. Oh, okay. That's interesting. I'm guessing it's that one. Boom. I just want the buttresses done. There we go. These little things you have to do to work around and stuff. I mean, it's fine. Uh, I tell you what we could do actually. What now we've got? We've got a lot of people who aren't builders, <laughs> um, who are who are unemployed, who could be builders. Is what I mean. Job. Let's have a look. I bet there's quite a few. Look at all these here. You can all be builders. You can all help me out because there's going to be a lot of building from now on. And we can always take you off the job later on if we need people, but for now, get building. You swines. Okay, I think I think this needs another one of these uh, on this side as well, doesn't it? Yeah. But maybe not as high up. Yeah, it does. It needs one there as well. Start construction on that. And then, and then, obviously, we're not going to have buildings all the way. So the other thing we need to look at doing is having, uh, uh, I, th I think, tavern wall, light stone brick wall. What does that one look like? Oh, now that's nice as well. 
So there's that one. Um, there's Water Stream, which I find quite interesting. I don't really know how that's meant to work properly, but... Dry... Dark Stone, yeah, okay. There's this one with Ornaments? Oh, okay, yeah, with... Uh, spikes, Tavern Wall. No, Joe, I think it's the Tavern Wall. I think it's Tavern Wall that I like. There we go. There we go. So we're going to follow this for the most part. There we go. Like so. So that's going to that's going to act as the uh as oh hello. Ooh, boop, 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 boop. The edge for a lot of it. Um it isn't very high, is it? I don't think there's a higher... The only higher one, I think, is this large stone wall. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. See, as much as I like the um, the tavern wall, I think the height of this one is going to be is going to be the thing that really clinches it for us, actually. So we will follow the edge around to about here, and I want to I want to dock here. So there we go. Curve those all in because. Makes them follow it a bit better. Let's have a look. Yeah, that definitely definitely suits it a bit more, doesn't it? The height wise, it's not like I say. The the wood is is a little bit more fort as opposed to castle. But what I'd really like is just a wall that did that did buttressing on it. But yeah, for now, I think that's probably the way to go. One of those is built. So a few places then where we need some uh, some some stuff. The problem is we're going to struggle to put stuff up here, aren't we, I think. Let's have a try. Fantasy decorations. Can we... Yeah, it's going to want to put them down there, unfortunately, isn't it? Yeah. Even if we try and tab. That's a shame. It means these top bits are going to be quite plain. But, never mind. We can at least go to window set and put some doors on things. Uh, so we can do an arch door here. Okay, so we'll put there roughly the right space, lift it up. See, they are really, for some reason they do this. I, I feel like that's a bug. But it shouldn't matter here, because we can we can still sink it in, right? Okay, let's bring it out and do it. There we go. Two people decided to stay. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I suppose it's because everyone's employed there, right? That was the thing that was stopping us before. If people are unemployed, they won't hang around. Okay. People aren't really doing much there. How are we doing for stone? We've got plenty of stone. Just people aren't coming over here and working. This is done there. That looks good, doesn't it? Okay. All right, we're getting there. Right, now this is obviously going to take forever. And uh, I don't want to do it over like 10 episodes. So we're actually going to jump ahead a little bit till I've done a... Um, till basically I've done this all the way around. <laughs> okay, we've had a lot... Ha who, are you, who are you there in the black? Let me... Come here a minute. Who are you? What do you... What's your job? Oh, you're a tax collector. Oh, I like your outfit. Uh, anyway, sorry. Right, hello. Welcome back. <laughs> so I've done quite a bit. I've had to hold off um, to do any more. And I, actually, quite a lot has happened. I know I, I know. I said, oh, I'll just do some of this and then come back. And the problem with this game is you, it's one of those ones where you, you do something and you go, oh, I can't do that until I've got this. Oh, I can't do that because now I need this and then this and this and that adds up to that and that. So, big changes. First of all, I did what I said I wanted to do, which was to build like a dock around here. So there's loads of different parts. Really happy with how this has turned out. Fi figured out how buttresses work now. As long as you do them within the same building, they'll snap and you get nice and high. That's really good. So we've got to come around here, fencing around here. And then we've got uh, a set of sort of docks here with like a spinny wheel thing on that looks really good. Uh, that I've now realized is actually back to front. So I'm going to delete that. The reason I know it's back to front because there's another one over here the right way around. So I'll explain that in a moment. But first of all, uh, we'll put that back in a mo. Well, actually, we'll do it now on camera building. Look at this. Crazy, huh? Water mill set. Uh, so we want it to be that way. There's one for each side, which is awesome. Um, 
because that I thought that thing was like a weird fence, but it's not. It's to, to sort of usher the water in. Um, needs a building, so we we'll put the building down and click start construction, go back to parts and get rid of the building. Okay. And hopefully that will get a builder. Hopefully. We have builders. I got rid of some of them to do all those things. But anyway, uh, then I built this awesome dock with ship. Now, whether the ships could get down here, I don't know. But we haven't got a sea. This is a Riverland uh, map. So I'm kind of happy with it. I think it looks really good. The only problem is I can't put any of this stuff up onto here, which I would love to do. Um, but this stuff is all attached to the ground. So as you put it under here, it just tries to put it on the sort of like down there. So I've done a little bit, but overall, it's end up going to be a little plain, unfortunately. Excuse me a second. <coughs> Excuse me. So uh, that's that. Then we have to carry on up this way. And then the other side, um, we've just done again. Same sort of thing opening here with a little sort of uh, nook up as well there. Look at this Riverlands. This is, no, Floodplains, this, this app is called. This uh, this one here, Floodplains. You can do rocks. Oh, we're, we're going to go mad with this sort of stuff. There was just a little bit of ground there. And I was like, you know what? That needs a little salt and salt. And we put a little salt and salt in. So what I might do, actually... Is rather than um, rather than follow the path perfectly on these, I might actually uh, there we go. I might actually purposefully come away a little like that, right? And then that just gives us those li those little areas. I mean, it, it's n it's such a small thing. But I think they look so good, especially those with the rocks and the reeds in them. That's just so neat. Um, we can do some of that, and we can these, especially these like tufts of grass. They really do look like reeds. Look at that, and then we can have some larger. Oh wow, there's really big ones. I didn't know that. Uh, maybe not that big. Yeah, that's good there. And they just get put there. And look at that. Just little details like that, I think, really do add a lot to it. So that's that. Now, one thing I realized quite quickly is very early on is this bit, This would be a ghost town, basically. There will be nobody going into here at all. It's completely all for show. So I thought about what I wanted to do. And I remembered saying that I wanted to move all the gathering professions out of the city up into this kind of space here. I downloaded an app, by the way, that, uh, that meant that I could just do free space because I, I'm not fussed about it that sort of gameplay now. We've, we've, we can manage a city. We built this. We're just making it look good now, all right? So I've opened up a little bit here, uh, and I've got I've got uh, foresters clearing out all of these uh, forest areas here, um, which is going to become all of our hop farms are going to move a little bit further out, all of our wheat farms, sheep, cattle, all of that's going to come up here, okay? Um, and then hopefully we can sort of feed that down here and then have more of the, uh, the next stage down here. So sheep comes to wool, wool comes down to here, and then eventually it's made down here. That's going to be the idea. Um, so I realized very quickly that this, all of the buildings by the fort would be really busy buildings, city buildings, okay? So I spent the time clearing this out. So this used to be our stone, okay? It's now going to be... Um, we'll probably do a little bit of a pier here and make these fishing huts look like they're part of the pier. We've got a, this is a, actually a working building. This is a flour mill. Um, so they make flour there, which is pretty cool. So we don't have to necessarily use the windmills. As much as I like the windmills, they do look good. They obviously don't fit in the middle of a city. We'll probably, play, you know, we'll place that a couple of these out up on the hill here to, for looks. But really, this is a this is a good way to, to make it. Um, now, unfortunately, nobody's really moving in at the moment. And I was, I don't know why, because the global happiness, nobody needs anything. Global happiness is fine. We have 10 novice that, that just don't seem to want to level up. So I can only assume that we have to make more of them commoners. Um, but again, I'll get to that again in a moment. So first of all, I've cleared all this area out then. Um, Un these are some of these entertainment buildings. I think all they really do is um, is raise the uh, desirability in the area, which is fine. Um, oh, we can actually put a person in there, but we have we don't have anybody. That's it. everyone's currently working, which is pretty crazy. Um, but if you look at the uh, the uh, desirability areas now, I mean this is a really desirable area. And they can build here. This is all now residential, look, you see. Even all of this as well can be all residential. There we go. 
So this is where I want houses to be, but nobody seems to be moving in. I don't really understand why. Um, other than maybe you can only have so many novice people, but nobody wants to level up from novice. Hopefully at the end of the month we can make some more commoners. I, I just, I don't really know. Um, there's a town square thing here that I'm trying to do. Again, all of this is to cover up things. So under there is a pile of rocks. So we've got a pile of rocks under there, and under here there's berries and rocks. I don't know whether you can even see them. There's some berries, look. Berries. Um, again, I want to try and make this more of a sort of centre of the town, really, than it spreads out. So we'll do the same here. We'll cover those up eventually. Um, but here's just like a little medieval pack that I found that's really good. Um, medieval fair. Tents and, and, and jousting gear and stuff. We could, build, we, could build a, we could build a jousting area. That would be pretty sweet. Oh, wow. I didn't even think of that. Gateway. <gasps> we could build a jet. We could totally build a Joseon area. Is there just like a regular fence? Yeah, there. Oh wow. Yeah. Okay. Rack with lances. Okay. Yeah. We'll we'll build a we'll build it. We're gonna build a fence. We're gonna build a Joseon area. That's cool. Um, we'll do that somewhere. Maybe here when this area gets cleaned out because there's not. We're not gonna get many houses in there. Um. So that was that happened. Then, so then I moved all of the production that was here, so the stone and the berries uh, and all of that from over here. I've now moved right into the middle of here, and you might think, "Well, that's crazy, Johnty. That doesn't make sense at all." Um, but what I thought was is that is that these forts they don't use they're not just a castle, right? Usually they are there are city there are houses in here as well. Usually like prime houses. So what I thought we could do is make two tiny little neighborhoods here and here. Right for for the the st the people that will eventually work in these, we'll have the big castle over here that we're going to do in the next episode, and then we can cover these up with stuff, or we can use um, the market and the medieval fair stuff to kind of tie tie it all together. Because that tent there, that looks okay. That could be a that could be a stone tent, you know, with all the stuff around it. I think these will actually work quite nicely as part of a larger market slash fair type thing okay that that's my idea and then that means it gets people up here it gets people moving through the area and it's not it's not good because one of the best things about this is seeing all the little all the little people running around you see that that's part of the best bit of the game really and i didn't think it looked very good if this whole area was just empty and just for show so having said all of that uh for some reason people just aren't turning up the global happiness is is fine it's just zero but you know Nope, they don't need anything. The one thing they were needing was luxury items. Now, um, all the luxury items, from what I can tell, are made from monks in the monastery. And we're not obviously building a monastery just yet. That's going to go up on the hill over here as its own little project towards the end of the series, I believe. Um, but they make all the stuff. They make the honey. They make the wine. They make the... the I think jewellery. I'm not too sure where jewellery comes from, to be honest. Uh, but one thing you can do is buy the honey in using trade so i've now got trade as as bringing 20 honey in we can afford it and then i've set up a luxury stall here in the main market selling honey uh as you'll see here honey seven honey sold this week for 80 gold there you go so pretty much all the all the posh people live around here anyway so they're able to get the honey but for some reason, yeah, Luck Zero decided to join your village. I can only assume it's got ten novice. I can only assume people are homeless. Um, but it's not letting me level up. It's not letting me level up. So week four, day six. Okay, it's at the end of the month here now, right? This is the end of the month. So let's see what happens when the when the end of the month thing pops up. It's we're still in day seven. But week four, day seven, that's that's the end of the month, right? Yes. No. Please. Hello. There we go. So we've got nobody to level up to serve. It's just commoners. I, I mean, do we risk going promote all just to see what happens? Just get no more serfs? It didn't cost us that much. It cost us like three grand. Enough promotions for today. Now the, the town should explode now. The house is upgrading, the house is upgrading, the house is upgrading. That's fine. But what would be nice is new houses, but no, it's houses upgrading, houses upgrading. Okay, that's fine. I've got no problem with that. So what are people... Global happiness is dropping down. It's not telling us why. It's not telling us why, but okay, that's fine. They're just all upgrading, so that, that's not a problem, I don't think. 
Yeah, I know you're all upgrading. That's awesome. So down here, what's going on here? Yes, here we go. We've got houses popping up there. That's good. So fish... Oh, that's just the fish's hut one. But there's a house. There's a house. So they're new, I think. Or they're just being upgraded, are they? Yeah, that's... that. I haven't put that down. That's a new one. Okay, building complete house. Where are these all being complete? All in, all in the height of town. Houses upgrading. So this area is doing well as well. Okay. Houses upgrading where? Okay, this is sort of accidentally becoming a little neighbourhood. I didn't really aim for that one, but that's fine. Houses upgrading. Building complete. Building complete. House. House. Okay. So, I was hoping that was the issue. People are less happy than they were. But there, there are 10 novice... 159 commoners. So why why can't I get those novices to level up to search? Because that's what builds new houses. Right? Because what happens is when they're a novice and they have nothing to do, they come and stand here. So let's see if we can hold on and see if somebody will come and stand here. There. Right. You. Commoner. Right. Okay. That doesn't... But look. House. You have no house. View home. Oh, it's getting built. Okay, well, that's fair. That's fair. All right, there's not much I can do about that. So you come and stand here while your house is being built. But that was my hope, is that we would we would spot a novice and see if we could figure out what the problem was. Um, doesn't want to... Who are you? Are you a tax collector? A bailiff? Oh, Christ, you wouldn't want him turning up, would you? Jeez. Okay, well, good for you, I suppose. Got a good job, haven't you? Right, here we go. Come on, let's see. Is anyone going to come and hang around, or is this sort of thing I'm going to have to do off camera? This is probably the sort of thing I'm going to have to do off camera. House is upgrading. Okay, so where's that? Where are you? Okay, that's fine, I suppose. This is This is starting to look like a little village now, right? They're not going to build much further down towards the dock. But like I say, I want to make this area a dock anyway. But yes, these, these, yes, yes, yes. Okay, this is good. Houses are getting put up. Okay, cool. Right, that's what I wanted. Now we just need some more people. Yeah, look at this. Okay. I'm not, I'm not too concerned about up there. Building complete house, building complete house. Okay. What I really wanted was this area to fill out. And, and it could fill out a bit more, but honestly, we could... We can put stuff in. Because let's have a look at our, our, our stuff producing. So we've got loads of bread. That's fine. But we have hardly any flour, look. And hardly any wheat, actually. That's I did. To be fair, I did lose a wheat field. Um, which won't have helped. We need to look at redoing our wheat fields over here. Over here, I think. Oh, that's going to be hops. No, here, here's wheat fields. We'll, we'll move sheep over to here. So... First of all, that one can go now because that's that's cleared that area out as much as I wanted it to. So we still have this one, and then there's also this one here. Um, I'm gonna get rid of you. That's gonna hopefully do that area. Let's just double check uh, extraction. Yeah, I want you to clear that out. I want to leave a few trees just there. Oops. All right. A few trees there for now, but all of this area needs clearing out. And yes, all of this as well. So you're doing fine as far as that's concerned. That area there for some more uh, stuff. That can all go. Uh, uh, hunting. Let's move the hunting area to over here, I suppose. Doesn't really matter too much, does it? Okay. All right, charcoal's got to go. We need to move you over to the other side of town. I know, I know, coal's going to have to stretch to get here, but the charcoal can't go there. So you're going to have to come down here to the to the uh, the busy area down here where the actual wood is. That's good. Um, so yeah, milk. We've got loads of milk. Milk doesn't particularly go anywhere. Beer. We just we can't make it quick enough from it. So it seems. I, I even I've put down another brewery. Let's give somebody a job there then to see if we can make some more beer. Um, cheese is fine. 
we've got a lot of milk in, which is kind of wasted space. So dairy farm, cheese maker. Could, we could definitely get a cheese maker in here somewhere. Because these final buildings, you see, these don't affect... Um, uh, these don't affect the uh, area. So we can put one of these down. And it, and it won't make the desirability any less. It's only the base level stuff, the farms and stuff, that what really messes up with the desirability. So things like that are good. It provides jobs. It um, you know increases the, the area. Okay, good. Okay. I think I, I want to... I, I want a joust in place there. That's going to be the next episode. I, I, I don't even care. <laughs> so, yeah, hopefully. Next job, then, really, is to move the wheat fields up to here. Um, Really, all of this area here. Did we? Are we going to move all the sheep over to there? Or maybe keep some sheep here? I don't like those two where they are. But we could move them to here and not really affect anything, couldn't we? So let's do that. So it still still kind of looks the part. I mean, really, they could do... We could do something like this and make like a trifecta building. That I think will look pretty cool. But look, no one decided. People are lacking... 81 village... Oh, right, they all need clothes now. Sure, of course they do. Uh, okay, well, in that case, we'll have to sort that out too. I forgot that clothes were the big commoner thing that nobody's now got. Um, we have 20. You can't make them quick enough, look. Yeah, we're going to have to produce some more clothes. So, uh, okay, next episode, then more clothes, jousting, cool space, and then a bit more work on the interior of this. Good stuff. Thanks for watching. Till the next one, be good.